Hi, Junior High. Mrs. Stewart here uh, for week number seven of e-learning. It's so strange that we have made it this far, but that's where we're at. Okay, so your assignment. I'm going to read because I have it all written down. Um, you're going to use object number 18. Object number 18. And object number 18 has decided to have some fun. They're going to either skateboard or surf. So you get to decide which one that happens to be and how is this accomplished? Um, I know your objects have such a difference in what they actually are. Uh, so if it's, uh, if your object's a house, how in the heck can it skateboard if that's what it's doing? Or if it's surfing, how is that happening? Um, and that's just a random example there, but I don't know, you guys can come up with that. Uh, color 50% half of your paper, drawing and background included. Um, I'm not looking for full flourish backgrounds, just half of your paper will be perfectly fine with me. I know there's a lot going on, probably have a couple extra assignments uh, these next couple weeks, so I want to try and make it a little bit easier on you too. Okay, and this assignment is due on May 8th, so Friday, May 8th. So keep that in mind as you organize and prepare all your homework and everything. And I'm trying to get this posted early so you have a little extra time too. And I'm going to go ahead and post week number eight. Now, the reason why I'm doing this is so you guys have extra time. Uh, week number eight, we are only going to take assignments through May 15th, which is our last day of school, through midnight. And I know some people have been turning things in late, which I'm still taking, no big deal. I can totally handle that. But that last week, if I don't have it, I will have to put a zero in. And I would hate for you guys to have to have that for your final assignment. So I thought for week number eight, I would give you two weeks, two. Um, that way you have plenty of time to get it done. And hopefully that'll help. Maybe you'll have some extra time next weekend or something to that effect uh, to do that. So week number eight, and this is due on May 15th by midnight, May 15th. So week number eight. Um, and this is actually an idea from Father Zach. He gave this idea to me uh, when we started e-learning. And I had just been looking for the perfect time to work it in. And we actually... With week number seven assignment, we used all of our objects, which is great. I know we didn't quite make it that far last year, so I'm really glad we made it through our list this year, and I definitely wanna do a list again next year, so just know that. Um, but week number eight assignment, what I'd like for you to do, I want you to choose a Bible verse that has a meaning to you, special meaning. Um, it can be something like, it has given you extra strength. Uh, maybe it's a good thing to help you calm down. Um, I don't know, all Bible verses have such wonderful meaning to everybody. Maybe it brought you comfort or something. Um, maybe you have found one through this strange time of school and the way we're doing it. it who knows, I, I know you guys come up with a lot of different things that way. So maybe you have found a Bible verse that has brought you comfort. So in your sketchbook, I want you to write this Bible verse. Now, you may be as plain with your lettering or as fancy with your lettering as you want. I ask if you go fancy with your lettering, make sure it's readable, please. Please. Uh, I like to understand what you're actually writing there. Um, Otherwise, plain lettering is totally cool. Uh, I have no issue with that. And then if you guys can decorate around your verse, and these can just be little symbols, um, blocks of color, something like that. I am not looking for background at all on this. No background for number eight, week number eight. Um, with background, it's gonna to be too complicated on the paper and having all the writing and everything. So no background. Just decoration on your lettering um, and make sure it's readable, please. Okay, so week number eight will be due May 15th by midnight. And let me jump back. Week number seven will be due May 8th. 
by midnight, of course. I, I'm totally cool with midnight. May 8th, okay? I understand that might be a little confusing. Just watch your video and you guys will be fine. I'll put some clarification um, on Google Classroom for you too, uh, just so you have it all there. So hopefully, I'm hoping, uh, just giving you guys extra time on week number eight assignment, maybe that'll work out for you. We'll see. Um, if you run into problems, please let me know. Uh, I'm always here to help. Uh, even if you need a tiny bit of help with some brainstorming, I, I can help you with that. I can't give you full ideas, but I can help you brainstorm a little bit. So uh, two assignments. One is due Friday, May 8th. One is due Friday, May 15th. All right. Good luck, and I'll see you guys soon. Bye.